All right, let's find out which of these two metals is a 303 stainless steel. I read the instruction manual. I reviewed the safety data sheet. It asks for a drop of solution and I put a paper on each metal. And it says, press down on the sheet and hold it. Sometimes the color reaction happens quickly, like within 15 seconds. Other times it may take longer. It depends on the uh, nominal uh, composition of the alloy. Um, but what we're looking for is 303 stainless steel will generate a, a brownish color on the paper. And other stainless steels, like a 304 or a 316, will not generate that same brown color. The part number for the paper is the 0400 uh, sulfur test papers, and I'm using solution number six all found in the kit called the Sulfur and Steel Seeker Kit number 1516. Uh, always in stock at Kozlov Scientific Company. Just a little bit of downward pressure on the paper, ensuring that the paper and the drop of solution is in full contact with the flat surface of the metal. So this time we did the test for two minutes. Let's take a look at the results. One of these, this one has a lot of brown on it. Brown pretty much all over the surface of the test paper. This has a couple specks, but they're mostly black and darker. So this would be a positive result for uh, 303 stainless steel. And that's correct. It says 303 on this one, this metal. This is a 316 stainless steel. So please observe the results. Thanks for watching.